It's Trovika TV in all social media handles Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. It's Jovika TV. YouTube. Subscribe and get all notifications. There are 10 things you must take very cognizance of before you think of traveling to any country of your choice. Do you know that in America, the most successful immigrants are Nigerians? The most successful immigrants. It is a Nigerian that has done what no doctor has ever done in the history of medical field. Bringing out a baby from the mother's womb and operated on, on the baby, put the baby back to the mother's womb and the baby was delivered after nine months. Only Nigeria has broken that record, has done it. Now, why am I talking about this? These are potentials. These are treasures that emanate and come up from Nigerians wherever they find themselves. But unfortunately today, because of the wicked and um, corrupt government we have, the Nigerian has been painted a very wrong picture. Go to all the prisons of all over the world, you will find that Nigerian, they are there. And the worst of it all, even our so-called African brothers are still keeping Nigeria. If you are flying to Ethiopia, if you are trying to any country using Ethiopia airline, when you arrive at Ethiopia, sometimes they will tell you without any reason. After searching, just because you have a green passport. Now, based on all these things, these are ways to fight Nigerians not to travel, but they are the most traveling country, the immigrants in all over the world, the most traveling immigrants. So now, I want to bring you up to speed. If you are anyone who have interest to travel, they are to go for a visa to whatever. There are 10 things I want you to bear in mind so that you don't get it wrong. What are those 10 things? Number one, Develop interest in a particular country. Don't just say, I want to travel anywhere that is possible. You are a confused man if you come to that level. Develop interest. I want to travel to such a country. Even if you have, want to have an alternative, make, make sure that your alternative is the both countries are almost the same thing. For instance, you want to travel to Malaysia? You can say, I want to travel to Malaysia or any Asia country. Or Malaysia, Indonesia, the Asia, they keep sharing. So we're talking about Europe. It's okay. I want to travel within Europe. We don't want to leave Europe. And you must have your reason for making sure. Not just so, uh, let me travel even if in Canada or Europe, but that you are confused. If you're talking about no, America, America, Canada, Mexico, blah blah blah. Make sure you choose a country that is in agreement with what you have in mind to be. That's one. Number two. Take time to study that country. Take a study, a survey, a study of the particular country of your interest. Because by studying, you'll be able to know how to approach most of those countries. There are some countries you don't need visa. If the visa is at a river, some are free visa. But if you don't know the story, an agent will charge you money and take you to that country. There are countries that when you go, they cannot even work. But the agent is ready to do paper for you and dupe you and take money. Like I have an agent telling me that uh, 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 visa to Jamaica, so visa to this place. Some will tell you, do a, if you do a visa to this whole country, you will just uh, travel by road and enter America. So easy. So easy. Be very sure before you spend a huge amount of money for any country you have never studied about. Go and take time, study that country. Number three, begin to future begin to feature in that country featuring remember they say you cannot feature in the future you have never pictured so begin to feature in that country see yourself in that country in the realm of the spirit you now what you see in your heart is better is more real than what you see with your eyes if you can dream it you can achieve it any building today you see must have been achieved by its skeleton by the architectural work 
So have an architecture of the kind of country you want to be. Begin to see yourself in that country. Learn their languages. If you, what I mean, language, know what the, the kind of language they speak. Learn how they greet. Know their religion. Know their culture. Know their mode of dressing. Because there are some countries, you become so friendly with them when they see you addressing, dressing like them. These are the things you need to know. Study the country. Then, number four, begin to save money for your journey. Ten things you must prepare before you embark on any journey. Save money. When I talk about save money, both the money you're going to use to process your visa and money you have to keep in account as an evidence to show that the person traveling is not going to run away from that country. Show them, don't let them see you as coming to consume users. Then, look for an agent. That's number five. Look for an agent to help you if you cannot apply by yourself. But most of these countries, you know you can easily apply by yourself just to go log into the website. But some of us are not conversant with uh, logging in and, and in and out. Well, so what do you do? Look for an agent, but make sure the agent is trusted. Number six, be very careful before you part with your money to any man. If you can write an agreement, that will be fine. If you can know the person to his house, not just office. So when the person runs away, go to his house. I know the people say, how much are you paying me that you make it to work? But have some level of trust you are built up around the person. Even though, even if no person, even your wife can still dupe you if they want to dupe. But try as much as you can be careful so that you don't get heartbroken by the, saying they dupe you. The number seven, book your date for your visa. Make a time book date for a visa. In Nigeria now, booking visa for America is very, very strenuous. It doesn't, it's not palatable. People have been booked their visa to 2027. So some of you, you can use most of the Francophone country as an alternative. I'm giving you the secret now. That one will be detailed. If it, although we can talk about it privately if you come. Number eight, prepare for the visa day, the day you are going for an interview, prepare for that day. What do I mean by prepare? You can be prepared for your journey entirely, but prepare for that day. Make a time, prepare for that day. If you are the person that believes in prayer, pray. If you believe in consultation, consult. Then make sure you are there in the city a day before that day, even not two days. To avoid where my flight was cancelled, I had a breakdown, blah, blah, blah. Be in the city for the interview two or three, two, a, two, a day or two before the D-Day. Then, number nine, filter what you take in. Get information, but be very careful information you accept. If they give you information, still ask more people. Get them, download them. They know the one to take and the advice to go with. It's very, very important. Filter what you take in as an advice. Please, it's very, very important. Then finally, and the least and the last and not the least, never you disclose your plans with the wrong people. This one is important. Make sure you don't disclose your ambition with the wrong people. They will fight you. People are not happy that people are progressing. Let me share this story before I end this video. There was a guy who came over here in America. So he had been working and planning for his family to join him. Finally, he went through a particular route and was able to succeed that the family was going to join him. They had an in date for interview, got their visas. The children got their visas. Meanwhile, the man is here with visiting visa and decided to know now. So when they got the visas, the woman started sharing the story. Glory be to God, we are finally got a visa. We are going to meet our husband. So I don't know who called the embassy and told them, I don't know how you got money to use this woman to go for this journey. The husband is over there. 
So, but when I planned my own, you guys did not give me. I don't know what I did to you people. They said, Who's human? They took her name. That was how that was done. They called her and said, Can you refund your passport? Uh, pass uh, they just wrote on the internet, the visa is broke. To share with the wrong people. Never you share your peace with your dream with the wrong people. See you again in this particular edition. If this video made a little of sense to you, please do well to share with somebody. Bye bye.